decided I wanted to study business at the University of Toledo, I had the difficult decision of deciding would I go back to my alma mater, which was BGSU, or would I change locations and maybe try something new. And the University of Toledo offered, I think, a comprehensive business program that would allow me to get the curriculum necessary to have uh, current experience with what's happening in the real world, and additionally have the programs and the uh, extracurricular activities that would essentially help me to develop myself as a business person. Uh, so I looked into the University of Toledo, spoke with some individuals here on campus, and I found that not only do they offer the business information that I needed in the business degree, they also had the areas of focus that included marketing, which was what I was mostly interested in and wasn't offered at other places I had looked into. I first heard about the Business Careers Program, I believe after receiving an email for um, a development program, and it was the how to mingle in a, uh, in a business environment. Um, uh, gathering. And so what we did was we learned, actually it was a, a business dinner etiquette uh, program. So a number of students met together, we dressed business casual, or business professional, and we had dinner, and we learned how to eat properly, <laughs> learned how to talk while eating, and learned basically what things can be discussed while at dinner. Essentially the idea was to give us the confidence that we would be able to balance two things, uh, being able to eat and socialize. In the meantime, maybe get a job, meet new people, network, and, um, and maybe solidify some relationships that we had had um, prior to that meeting. What happened was I had a, a resume that was mainly journalism focused. That's what I was, that's who I thought I was going to be. So it was so heavy in journalism work that when I went to new interviews and when I was looking into marketing um, internships or positions or when I was inquiring about uh, different positions, the people I was interviewing with would look and say, well, aren't you going to be a journalist? And that's not who I wanted to be. So Carol helped me to take exactly what I had done, all of my experiences, and what she did was she helped me to refocus all of my talents and all of my skills so that they were more business focused and marketing focused. So she didn't change anything about what I had done, she really just made me seem like the person I was ready to become, which was more of a marketer and more of a business person. And it's an absolutely beautiful resume, I'm so proud of it. It's really been helpful for me since it's been completed. If I was going to give advice to somebody who wanted to obtain their MBA, I would absolutely tell them to reach out to the individuals in the Business Careers Program. I have had so much help, I've created friendships, and, um, and really have the development that I need to become more of a business individual. And I think that people assume that going to college is about getting A's and getting good grades and sitting in class, but there's so much more involved with being involved in business especially. It is important that you have proper etiquette, it's important that you're networking, it's extremely important to have experience. And I do think that this uh, program does help myself and will help others to really develop themselves professionally and essentially get into the careers that they expect to be in. I just do highly encourage and think that it's important for any student, really in um, whether they're MBA or undergrad at this point, to seek as much assistance as they can. Um, having the confidence and being a good student are all excellent characteristics and, um, and those people should definitely only congratulate themselves for working very hard, but there are aspects of the business world that are mostly hidden. I've heard this term, these hidden rules and hidden norms of the business world and I've been exposed to so many new ideas and um, I really couldn't have done it alone and I don't plan on continuing to do this alone. I will continue to reach out to everybody that I have and hopefully meet new people that will continue to keep me on the right track.